What's good, y'all, man? Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me let me pause that video. Let me pause that. Hold up. I didn't even think that was going to count down that fast. I literally watched that go down from like 8, <clears throat> 9, 10 ish. First of all, bro, this video right here is different. Let me tell you why. Because my nigga's doing it. You feel me? I know both these dudes personally. I was on an episode, actually, one of his early episodes. And this right here. It's not a podcast for real. It's a reunion. That's why I'm wearing this fit. I was kind of dripped out. I'm the only person who got this full tracksuit. Dripped out. You feel me? That's actually terrible. I want to throw that up so bad. Why well, not? But yeah, I know both of these two guys personally. It's gangs. So we about to get into it. I'm not gonna watch the whole video because as y'all may not know yet, he told me, let's see. The video should be somewhere around I wanna say forty something minutes, fifty minutes, somewhere around there like that. But we don't get into a nice proportion of it. Every time they go through a topic that I want to talk about, skip it through it. This video probably going to be like maybe 10 minutes. Every time they talk about a topic that I want to talk about or elaborate on for y'all, we're going to do it like that. So let's get into it. Let me make my screen smaller real quick. I should I go over here? Over here. Then I can fly be like, yeah, bro. It's really crazy I know how to use YouTube now, bro. Like, I'm just a nigga from the hood. That's it. There's no way I know how to use YouTube like this. Yo, it's your boy OMG Kim. We in Dallas, Texas right now, and I'm finna chop it up with my boy Mar, man. Let's get it. For what? That's low key hard though. That's like some old school. That's an old school feel. I like that, Jamar. Snip it from kid day. I had it first. Man, I think that song going on Persona too. If y'all know what Persona is, that's uh, OMG Ken, the dude on the left side right there with the glasses on. He dropping an album. Ken Day is for Ken. That's that's his name. You feel me? OMG Ken. He dropping an album pretty soon called Persona. I think he was previewing a song that came out. That's coming out soon. Got me in the background taking pictures. It look efficient. I got some real hard flicks in. Oh man, I want to lucky get to when they start talking. Is this his intro? I want to see that too. Oh, copyright. Come on, Jamar. You got to know that now. Oh my God. All right, man. We back at it, back at it again. Oh, this boy's got to be. Everybody, patience. We're here for episode seven of Chop It Over More. Uh -huh. man, let's get it, man. I'm excited. I got man. my boy and my boy. OMG Ken in the building. I appreciate you coming out, gang. That's the word, everybody. How you feeling? Fool, it just really drives me when he hit that little keyboard and he be making all the different sounds, bro. That really drives me. I'm not going to lie. Like, who does this nigga think he is? DJ MV looking at it. Bro. Was that lame? And I feel great, man. Blessed. Blessed to be here, man. I know we had some technical difficulties last time, but we, we here in all spirits, high spirits. You know what's funny? The technical difficulty, difficulty, dang, I can't talk. Difficulties they talking about is when we was at, uh, we had, they recorded a first episode of Airbnb and the camera stopped working miraculously. And I feel like, I feel like Jamal wanted to say it was me that did it. Cause I walked past that camera fool and then I, the camera was recording when I walked past. And then after I left, the camera was not recording no more. So I don't know what happened, you feel me, between that time period. But when it stopped recording, I was not there, I don't think. I think I went to go park my car or something like that. Because the parking in downtown is freaking crazy, bro. 
But yeah, let's get into it. Let's find some more things. Serious, man. So I'm just supposed to be here, man. I appreciate you for This video is too long for me to just like sit up here and listen to everything, even though I do want to meet Rod and do it anyways. I can't. You know what I'm saying? If y'all want to watch the full video, you got to go to my boy Jamar channel. Actually, I think I may leave a link to the video. Yeah, I'm definitely going to leave a link to the video in my uh, description. Let's just find out where they're going through topics and stuff like that. See what they was talking about. It seemed like yesterday when I was just literally in the closet recording that whole album. Like, I never <laughs> expected the album to be what people told me it was. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, bro. I always, you know focus on perfecting my craft at all times but you know when love and parties came and whenever i was recording it just felt different and like i said i didn't know that it was gonna have that turnout if y'all don't know what they're talking about let me elaborate on that for you love and parties is the album omg ken dropped last year on june the 30th that's his birthday every year around his birthday he gonna get ready to drop something that's a little leak but all y'all fans that didn't know or don't never know when he gonna drop he always gonna try to drop an album around his birthday time this year we waited a little bit longer for persona but that's okay though i, I live with that i live with that it better be hard though that it had but at the same time like i still felt like it was my art that i created like it was my first actual project that i locked in on something <laughs> yeah. like really started focusing up and felt like I put in like all my time, all my effort, all my money into it. And it just, it, it paid its dues, man. Like it really turned out good and it gave me that platform that I needed. So, uh, man, I, I. Nah, that album did go stupid. Like, I don't know if I could react to music on here just because of copyright issues, but if we could, we definitely would react to that whole album, bro. The album went stupid. I really enjoyed that project, man. And, and for it to be one year old today, man, or, or a couple of days ago. It's amazing. It's an amazing feeling, man. For sure. That's what's up, bro. I'm turning the captions off because everybody know niggas don't need captions. Captions is for, for females because they don't listen. You know what I'm saying? Females use captions because they don't listen. They like to read. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, I ain't going to lie. Like, me personally, you know, it's my boy, but I, I genuinely think it was no misses, no misses on your on that album, bro, and so like, man, nah, I, <laughs> you know, a lot of people, a lot of people have different opinions, man, but I let the people speak for that, but I know what you're talking about, like, I, I, I appreciate that, because a lot of people, a lot of people really, you know, usually say the same thing, and I don't know, that's up for y'all to decide if there's any misses on there, but, I gotta, I gotta, them, I gotta ask though, like, Love and Parties, like, I know that's the title, yeah, first off, I want to say, just also, Ratchet stuff. I'm not cutting none of that out because I'm tired of editing. I've been editing all week. I'm not editing that out. Y'all just heard me tell my little brother he got to be gone right now. You know what I'm saying? He little brother. I'm big brother. I, I handle that. You know what I'm saying? I know you You dropped it on your B-Day. Uh -huh. You start out the first song on the album is hey, Happy B-Day, Ken. Yep. I, think, I think that's... The just a forewarning, this video is definitely going to be past seven minutes. I mean, ten minutes. It's probably going to be like 15, 20. That came into a fool. I mean, any time when on there that have been like the type of feel that you're gonna be in that, that and hey whoever breaking my heart keep breaking my heart because like you you making the music better my <laughs> bank is gonna come no you cap break my boy you making, you making the art for me so that's just how i feel like the love aspect just it makes me like want to record it makes me want to tell people how i'm feeling because i actually like make my music based on how i feel like that's actually truth like everything that i rap about is truth everything that i sing about is truth is no that's facts for sure for sure uh, right now, I'm not gonna lie, I would hate for me to get all the way to the end of this video and realize my audio was not working right. So this is what we gonna do. You know what? That's cool. We'll just leave it like that. We'll just leave it like that for right now. Yeah, that's cool. Let's go, let's get no lies it. in it, no lies in the lyrics. So it's just like that's how I feel at all times, bro. I feel like it relates to the whole crew, to to the all the guys. Like it don't matter what song it is. But I See, whatever he say, crew, guys, whole gang, anything like that. Some slimy finna come out, and I feel like because he did call me during this interview to ask me a, a, a question. It wasn't too slimy. I handled it the bit, the most peeest way I could. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm super pee. Let's see, let's see what he finna say though. I feel like, like that music it represents us. I mean, I know it's you, definitely. It it, it, I know it's you, but it, but it represents us. So I mean, like, I gotta be honest. When it comes to these songs, is it fully? Is it all personal experiences, or do it? Cause you, I'm gonna put like, like okay, knowledge. Now, now, I get what you're yeah, saying. Yeah, I get yeah, what yeah. you're saying. No, no, I get what you're saying. One hundred percent. Like, I personally, I feel like a like I'm gonna say it's a nice 
70-30 balance. Yeah, I was going to say, that's exactly what I was going to say, too, because, like, I feel like all the souls he relate to, they do relate. I ain't going to even say that. Now, nah, I'm going to say just us, bro, because I know a lot of niggas that don't move around like how we be moving. So if you listen to OMG Kid music, bro, and you vibing out, you listen to lyrics, like, ooh, that's hard. Most of that stuff comes from stuff that he'd have been through. And then at 30, I would say around 60, 40, 70, 30, I agree with, too. I wouldn't, I wouldn't uh, debate against that. You feel me? Like... That's like uh, those are experiences that we didn't like really chopped it up with like like they didn't really have to go through yeah that that's about right that's about right like seventy percent of my songs that's like personal experience Facts. like everything that I see everything that I feel everything that I like endure yeah. on a daily basis anything catastrophic it's in my songs and that's just how like <clears throat> it's planned out you know what I mean and I wouldn't even say planned out it's just like how it's structured like. Because I have nothing else to talk about but how I feel or my personal experiences. The other 30 is, like, things that I that's, have been around me, you know, that have, like, influenced, you know, like. Yeah. You know. That around me, a.k.a., is what me and the game been doing. I'm not going to lie, but he, it's on, he, he tied in with a lot of people, though, bro. So, it's like, I know he done heard a lot of crazy stories. Now, kid, I would keep it a band. Jamar. Crazy, he low down. He, we, we, bro, not gonna lie. We all, not, I ain't gonna say we all low down. We all live on the back end, bro. We live for that, that moment, that rush, adrenaline rush. We live for that, you know what I'm saying? Ken, that he be chilling, but sometimes he'll stick. He like, what's the little fish name off of Nemo? Oh, the, that was dumb. The fish name is Nemo. Uh, kids like Nemo. You feel me? Like, you see when that, that clip with Nemo had touched that, that boat and he knew it wasn't supposed to? That's what Ken do. He like to go touch the boat sometimes and he get back he get back just right in time so he ain't get eat up by big fish or something like that. Now, me on the other hand, I done got ate up by big fish. I went to go tap the boat. They caught me. They fr fried me, grilled me, cooked me, all kind of stuff. The rest of the game, we done all been in some pretty sticky situations. We done got fried, grilled, and cooked. Ken will smack that boat and get back right just in the, in the right nick of time, bro. I'm not going to lie. So, I can vouch for that. You know, those feelings. Whether it was like something that my homeboy had happened to me or like happened to him or like something that my family going through, like music. For sure, for sure. So uh next question I was gonna ask, hold on, I had a little little moment. Explain I wanna understand like I know before I even ask that, what's your favorite song on that album on that album, bro? Or or you can go with that album and then let me know out of all the songs that's released. What's your favorite song? Okay, we're gonna start with Loving Parties because it's kind of, it's kind of. Loving Parties is material, girl. Any bets in the comments? If I get this wrong, I do a hundred push-ups right now and post it on TikTok and do a cringiest TikTok dance ever. I want to say it's material, girl. All right, like I hate <laughs> this question honestly because, like, as an artist, like it's so hard to choose just one song, but. If I were to go with like one song that I really just I can play all the time off the album, it's Material Girl. I do it. Hey, what I tell y'all? What I tell y'all? So that that means what that means since I got it right. Drop y'all mama's number in the comments and watch how many mamas I pull. It's, like, it's just it's so different. Like I'm gonna be honest with you, that song, like even before <laughs> that song, that song, that song was one of the ones I I, I really really Material go hard, bro. But now, I mean, you, you gonna understand what I'm talking about due time. So like after, you know what I'm saying, events yeah. and stuff, that song means something else to me. I, I, I really, really, material go hard, bro. But now, after... I know exactly what song you finna say, too. I can't remember the name of it, though. But I know how to say it word for word. Anybody who, who related to us, not related, but I want to say, like, tied in with our gang. I look click those. The people y'all always gonna see me with. Anybody who who in our circle know this song word for word. After, at, in due time, like after, you know what I'm saying, events yeah. and stuff, that song means something else to me now. Like that's yeah. all, that's all so much more to, <laughs> that's all so much more. You, you gonna understand what I'm talking about in due time. I already know, <laughs> I already know what you're talking about. No no, they'll find out soon, but nah, that song, like, it's so, it, it, I could time travel off that song, if that makes Facts. sense. Like, it puts me in a time period, and that's how. It's really crazy watching my niggas. Like, do this not look good, y'all, bro? Like, this is a well put to. This is this is a well put together. This like, look at the background, look at all it. Like, this is a well put together, like, just overall video. Like, I like, I, I'm loving this video. I know, like, I really enjoy the song because, like, it puts me back in a time where it's like, dang. But we gotta skip to some some more stuff, bro, because this is closing up on 15. Girl, for some reason, like off the top, like it was, it was something.
Bro, nah, that's what's up, bro. That's all right. do it, man. But nah, shout so out wait. to them. But that was that's actually crazy. And it's funny because I still got both of their verses. On. I was just gonna say you got the verses. I'm gonna have. But that was. Shout out to my Two brother. Fives. Shout out to my. Shout cousin, out Supreme man. K. Yeah, shout out that's to both crazy. Of my guys, but they was both on that song, bro. It's crazy because they talk about material girl. Now he talk about Brandon and uh and uh Kenton, bro. He gotta be. He gots to be, man. Yeah, yeah. I kicked them off because they was in the closet playing too much. Yeah, you know, I already know how that shit gonna be. That nigga Kenny is gonna be there like, y'all gotta get out. I gotta focus. But. <laughs> <laughs> I hey, told they had to that's leave. funny, bro, for you to say that. And they never. I would have expected Supreme. I would expect my boy to even say something be like, bro, I'm really supposed to be on that. I ain't <laughs> never heard nothing keep like it that. P, that's how you play it, bro. Nah, that's. <laughs> that is P, though. Hey, Big Slime gonna always keep it P, bro, y'all. If y'all be on my Snapchat or anything like that, you already know, bro. He the most P is player. Like, if he got anything to say, it ain't gonna be around a lot of people. He gonna keep it P at all the time. That's why we gonna respect that, man. What's up, bro? That's all right. do it, man. But nah, shout so out to them. But that was, that's actually crazy. I'm like, Let's hey, get some bitches. Pusher, I hit this shit. Yeah, yeah, touch yeah. On that. It's crazy, like a big transfer, so... Exposure has to be my number one outside of love and party. Facts, facts, facts. So I gotta um we're gonna get back to like, you know, the music the music side of Ken, you know what I'm sure. saying? OMG Ken. Sure. Now I gotta ask, explain what is your persona? Now I only I, uh, that like all into him. Never stop doing that, but you know, for the main wanted to make it in time when I could connect more hats you'll see a lot more versatility Ooh, with I need, you know i need the hat we got man. some we got some nice <laughs> yeah. stuff coming man oh like, but after a close you don't even you don't even have it like set right. out just for you exactly so yeah. that's that's what explain i want that to for touch me. on explain that for so me, like when my when my clothing drops like i make it where you can't just go back and, and keep purchasing them you know like a lot of people are asking me like why don't you have a website why don't you have an active link where we can go and buy this stuff and shout out to kanye but i didn't i didn't want to do that like, I wanted to make it and build rarity, like, within my clothes. So, like, I have it where people can purchase it one time when I drop it, but after it's dropped, it won't release again. He thinks differently, bro. He's not the first person to do that. I'm not going to lie. He's the first person I've heard do that. I heard he just shouted out Kanye. So, maybe Kanye did that first. I'm not really a hype beast. Anybody who knows me know I wear straight Jordans, and that's probably about it. A rock a lot. Jordans is the most hype beastest thing I have in my closet for real. Nike Tex and Jordans, like. But yeah, he he does do that. Like me personally, bro. Me personally, bro. People are always asking me like, how do you get OMG can? How how do I get a jacket? How do I get a hoodie? Bro, like, you got, it's literally an owner's story. He'll have, like, a Purple Heart slide up, and you can purchase that when you want to, bro. Orders come in quick, too. And that's, like I said, it's just going to build, oh, I'm a, like, versatility. You'll see a lot of attention to yourself, you know what I mean? That's what's going to be the biggest point with my clothing. I always want to make eight being, you know, restricted to one area of expertise. So now I got to ask, what, what's been your greatest, your greatest hardships? Well, do whether it's music or... What's your greatest heart? Or life in general, bro. Like, what's what's a time where where you felt like you would... Hey, y'all. Uh, Big Slime just called me miraculously while I'm on stream. Hey, Slime, we recording right now. What's good, my brother? So you doing what? We recording a, a live reaction. Keep it pee. Oh, oh for real? Who you recording with? Now nah, I'm Dolo right now. React to uh, Jamal Video, Big Slime. They out of okay. town right now. Thug okay. it. What it is? Yes, yeah, sir. That boy tapped in. What's up, my brother? I'm vibing, though, you know. I just called it, you know, touch base by some real pee. <laughs> peppers. Uh, nah, I'm pushing. I just called to talk about some real nigga shit. But, you know. Uh, I'm hey, give me, like, I'm give me, like, uh, one minute, then I'm going to hit you back. So. Hey, right. you know what I'm saying? Just finish that little video and then just, just touch me what you done. All right, my boy. I'll talk to you. Uh, Slap. That's big slime. And a lot of people, a lot of people gonna be like, "Why you just didn't edit that out?" Like, why y'all got? Cause, bro, like, we really locked in. Like, they're my niggas. It was um, like you just hit a rope. People that are talking to me, I probably have more business endeavors and connect. Man, how you like, look at it? From the the jump, 
I'm honestly gonna say, like, I love making music, but I was just, music has always been around me, like. Showing it, it's actually really showing everything that, bro, you're doing. Because I, like, on Instagram, you could be man. looking on YouTube, learning how to fix it, bro. Facts, bro, I remember somebody had told me too, like, man, every day, every day you should be trying to do something to help you, like, be better at your craft. At least, right. you know what I'm saying? This should be a time of your day. Like, how did you build, like, uh, the consistent motivation to want to do this? I'm going to be Being in high school, I mean, I love sports. I love sports and I love music. Like, anybody... It's funny, because I heard him say this this story the other day, and it's always going to be funny to me. This nigga Jamar is one of the funniest dudes I ever laid my eyes on. Like, I could just look at him. I really got some clips... Like of some pranks I tried to pull them, but they was terrible, so I probably won't never ever post them. But yeah, this this video right here is gonna be funny, bro. We may aim for twenty five too, just another mark. I know that they know I love music. I listen to all types of music. When well, not say all types, but I, I definitely he don't have... listen to all types. The nigga think Lil Wayne better than Jay Z, so his music opinion is invalid already. But listen to ear for music Christ. and then like sports i just love sports so i mean after high school he don't love sports bro he sucked at all sports a b and he was he beat rides for every team that's good his favorite teams are the lakers and kansas city chiefs he doesn't know anything about hardships of a team he probably even like the lakers when they suck he definitely doesn't know what number jamal charles wore by heart so <sighs> cool. and i didn't i wasn't gonna play like collegiate ball and then like that i was like you know what let me try to let me try to get myself behind a mic in some way in the sense of whether it's me broadcasting sports or just then I realize I got I got friends as rappers, I got friends that Did I low key just do a federal on that? I low key did. I feel like a mark. I'm sorry, Jamar. That do that. Like there's so many people that I know that do stuff exactly. and that and there's so many conversations I'll be having with these people, like off camera, and it's just I learn so much from people, it's just like I gotta put this out. So it's really just the idea of just having to sit down. I'm always watching podcasts and stuff, so that's where it came from. But I was just like, you know what? Let me go ahead and put this in, put this in motion. Like I can't just sit here and exactly. not do that's nothing. That's part of your craft, bro. yeah, like, bro. That's, that's how it formulated Facts. you. Like the things, that, yeah. Like all the people don't have a call, but we all support. This. We support each because so turn. Oh, this so, is a Kenton. Yeah, man. All of us and something will pop out. You know, like they just show themselves. Like, dude, like naturally have like the skills that you naturally have people don't even notice them at first yeah but they just they generally like pop out you know like they just show themselves like i don't know how it happens i don't know what it does but like it just pops up one day and you just you have like a niche for something you got that itch like to want to do something good with the craft that you was using like man that's it's incredible to see like where all the guys are going bryce and kenton yeah, man. All of us. Nah, bro, I'm blessed. I'm bl we we blessed, bro. I mean, I be telling people all of that because a lot of people don't have, like, what we got, bro, in the sense of having a group of friends <laughs> that, like, all is working. No cap. Niggas finna make me cry. You know what I'm saying? Like, we all, like, we can have a phone call, but we all doing something. You feel me? Like Because we all hold ourselves accountable. Like, we don't all just turn into yes man and be trying to like you know turn into oh we're gonna support this guy just because social media tell us to or we're not supporting this guy by popular demand now we supporting each other because you know it's 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 in us like it's natural we don't have to think before we support each other man i'm gonna press that button i'm gonna like that post i'm gonna comment on that picture that ain't nothing, if, bro. My guy, if my guy doing that so that's what make us stronger that's what make the bond strong. then when you Hey, I, I'm not. I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna say nothing about that, bro. Speak for himself. He just hit the head. The damn. The, the, God, the, he hit the uh, hammer. He hit the nail on the. He hit the hammer on the nail. Oh my God, I should probably edit that out, but I'm not because I'm too tired to do any editing. This gonna go straight up as is. Twenty five minutes. It's twenty four now. It's definitely gonna be more twenty five. But we tie see. that in with all the craft that we got. You know, podcasts, interviews, cameras, music, basketball. It, Man, it's, the stuff, the stuff, bond. and we not even up yet. That's the thing. Like, I'm, I'm so excited, service. bro. I'm so excited we for the future. The service, we ain't, we just now starting slow motion, better than no motion. Right it's now, scary. I feel like the motion is slow because I know we can go. For, I know. Why you just say that cool phrase? Slow motion, better than no motion. <sighs> Anybody who don't know Jamar, bro, I know he'll be bad. I really need to post a one v one with Jamar. If y'all want to see that, let me know. Let me know something, but. Why he just say that slow motion better than no motion? Bro, shut, shut up for I don't punch on you, boy. No, I get. We can go hard and hard. That's scary. 
So now I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and ask. I'm just playing, Javon. I'm sorry. This is a couple icebreaker questions, gang. What's up? You know what I'm saying? Let's so let me, let me, let me start off with that. What type of kid were you? What was the kid you were at? Man. Uh, all right, let's start. Bad kid growing up. Yeah. Really interesting. I but you know, Mohawk. Yeah, I ate pick people. I was like, man, oh wait. Yeah. Uh, lying. Uh, what's your favorite thing? Uh, Plus, on to do and they put too, you in bro. that mood like that. That's a couple new on there. I, I used to think that was spaghetti the whole time. It wasn't. I don't even know what that. was. Bro, <laughs> don't do that. No cap on look, the podcast. Look at, at school. We nah, was in high bro. school, bro. <laughs> we right, was. I'm a, tell the story though, but don't cap to the. We podcast, was in high school, bro. bro. So we had to do some. We was representing the basketball team for something. Something for like I don't know what we was doing, but we was in the auditorium, bro. We chilling. They got like this little. Play by play, this little presentation video going. They playing the Toy Story song, You Got a Friend in Me. And Jamal dude, was singing it, bro. <laughs> dude, gonna get to singing in my, in my ear. ear, bro. This dude you was singing. I'm not going to lie to y'all. This is going to be one of the last things because I think we done caught up with the stream, so I'm not going to be able to skip ahead anymore. I would just end it off with this right here. From what I know about both these two dudes, here's how I think this went. And this story been going around for a long time, bro. This is how it went. I feel like the song came on, and Kitty loved this song. I don't care what he say, bro. Kitty loved this song. He said, I heard him sing it a lot. Like, he said, I, I heard him sing this song a lot. So I feel like Kitty may have started off singing it, and then Jamar will come in and sing it with him, and they both would just start laughing at it, and Jamar got caught doing it last. I feel like that's how it happened. Me, personally, that's how I think it happened. Oh. Bro, he do. I'm telling you, bro. That's how I feel like the story happened. <laughs> bro, you alive, bro. He gonna try to act like he wasn't even singing it, bro. I'm no, like, bro, bro, watch out, bro. What's wrong with you, man? Whatever, bro, game. Bro, this dude here, bro. I'm telling you, dog. All right, man. After hearing that, it may have been Javon, cause I can see Javon doing that like the song. Come on, he reach over and whisper in your ear. Uh, being a big freak. <laughs> All right, whatever, bro. All Most right. overrated movie, though. Oh, it's, yeah, yeah, what's up? Most overrated movie. I'm going a... I'm to say mine real quick. Go ahead, bro, because you probably sparked some inspo. High School mu Wait, is that Disney? Hell yeah. High School Musical. High School Musical overrated to you? Yes, bro. You sleep. I really think it like... High School Musical go federal. I under... Three times. Understand life sentence and the history and like what it meant, but like you obviously don't understand, bro, because they went off the porch when Disney was coming out, bro. Why we try? This is the type of stuff we literally argue about, bro. High school musical overrated, nigga. Really? At the same time, bro, growing up, I wasn't the one to be like. It was annoying to me, bro. I was I was one of them. Okay. When I was that kid. Be Let me guess. You watched Martin growing up. Be like, mm -hmm. man, I was too cool for High School Musical. Look at it. Okay, that's okay, that's okay. probably how that's I how think I look at it. Really have to do it. <laughs> yes. Okay. <laughs> now, now I want to ask. I got. I got. I got. I got to I gotta know. Come on, bro. <laughs> I got to know. Come on, Jamal. Come on, bro. Don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> come on. Gang. Come on, bro. I got. I got to know, gang. What's All right, the bro, What's the word? What's the worst you ever got caught up? Story time. Oh Ooh. man. <laughs> See, I'm gonna end it right there. That's that's hard. Those some stories that's gonna be hard for me to just like you feel me, just spoil it all. Cause I probably know the backstory on all of these, so it's not gonna be fair for me to spoil that for y'all. But yeah, y'all gonna tap in with that. You feel me? Go learn about us. Go tap in now. We early group of young creatives. Oh my God, this kalachi is just busting, bro. Look how it's glistening. Go go tap in with that's good. That's some good stuff. Go tap in now, bro. Well, it's early. Get to say you was, get to be a, get to be a, uh, want to put everybody on game. Like, be like, you ain't heard of these dudes? Woo, baby. Be a, be a leader, bro, not a follower, bro. That's our biggest thing, bro. We was always leaders. We ain't never follow. We ain't never asked for a hand down. You feel me? Be a leader. Go be a leader today. You know what I'm saying? This was a great video. Shout out to my boy, Jamar. I'm going to put the link to this video in the, uh, captions. Um... What else I got to say, man? OMG Ken going dumb. Drop Persona, bro. If, if you listen to OMG Ken, drop Persona, bro, for all, all the fans out here. And if you watch this whole video all the way through, uh, and DM me on Instagram, and I'll cash up you five bucks because this is a long video. So if you watch this whole video through, DM me. I got you with five bucks right now. But yes, yeah, sir.
You know what I'm saying? Like I said, if you want me to react to something else, drop it down in the comment section. You feel me? Or hit me up on Instagram at Bryce the Goat, and we'll try to get back to you with a, a, a video. You know what I'm saying? But I'm about to get ready to head out on y'all boys. Let's go.